Another day, another mirror ball. <laughs> I had to customize it for you. I had to customize it for you. You know what I'm saying? I have to say, y'all killed that. You have to feel good, win or lose, going out on a, on dances like that, right? Yeah, I think that was the most perfect way for us to finish our journey. And what I said to Josh right before we walked out was, whatever happens tonight, you have that moment forever. Yeah. It is not going anywhere. It will last longer than a trophy. It will live forever for you to go back and look at and be proud of yourself. And yeah. I think that is a huge thing. Yeah. I feel like you, you've said before, you came into this feeling kind of like an underdog. So you had to work hard to prove yourself and to, and to, and to grow here. Do you, you yeah. still, what do you, what do you, you still feel that way? Oh, absolutely. I've grown from, you look at it from day one to now, dude, I can go into any like dance studio or ballroom <laughs> and, and pick up frame and do so much stuff and talk dancers language. Right. Yeah. I couldn't do that before. Yeah, now you I do can talk do that. Now. You do. It's crazy. Yeah. You know, it's not just one sport. <laughs> I can cross over a little bit. Yeah. Well, you've and always had you've always had some crossover ability, I think. Yeah. Um, yeah she brought it out of me. I was gonna say, but you bring it. Up. People have talked about your choreography being the best kind of choreography, wow. challenging yeah, I mean, and showy, technical and uh, interesting. Do you feel like this is the kind of partner that brings it out of you? Did you have, finally have a match where you could really kind of dig into that? I think I've, I've had some incredible matches over the years, and my partner is uh, always my muse, right? So obviously that was fully inspired by him and the beast that he is on the field and, and what I think he brings to it. So I think my choreography is only as good as the muse that I have, and he was definitely a special one. Bloop. That's what we call that. Did we call that a uh, bloop. <laughs> I know, and it's crazy, you know, it's almost like a, a close but no cigar moment. And it's, yeah. you know, it's almost like, dang it, dude, it was so, you know, we did so much. Yeah. And then just for her, you know, come out here and put so much into it. I mean, she's extremely deserving. Yeah. And, you know, someone is going to give it to her because she's been a beauty this whole one time. One day, babe, one day. <laughs> one day soon. I, tell me, though, about Adam winning the mirror ball. Because it's not just about ballroom dance, right? This is also America Vote. Yeah. And there, I can't remember a time there has been a, a man like Adam who has won this contest. Yeah. For, for this franchise, for this show, what does that mean, you think? For me, it's an incredible, see, uh, an incredible thing to see someone like Adam win and a very openly gay man and very proud. And he, he had that journey in the Olympics. And then you come to a show where we haven't had a man like Adam win before and who honestly came out in dances a little more feminine than some of the other guys that dance on our show. And I think seeing our audience and our fans accept and love that and really uh, bring that into our Dancing with the Stars family and vote for that says a lot about how much we're growing as people and as, as a nation. Yeah. yeah. How about you, sir? It's evolving. I mean, I think We're that's evolving. what you, you think you can see things that are evolving into such. And, you know, they, they've been doing a great job since day one. You know, they came out here and just crushed it. And so to go throughout, you know, each and every week with two dances and go out there and put on a performance, I think, you know, America saw that and they, they voted for it and they wanted someone to come out here and do, you know, something that's a little different than others. Mm -hmm. And he did that and it showed and, you know, he was justified the rightful runner. And yeah. at the end of the day, that's just what it is. Okay, so we see the tape, right? Yeah. And oh, I saw it live. <laughs> <laughs> it's terrifying. I was behind it like, no. <laughs> How bad was he hurt? You know, he was just a little, you know, dinged up a little bit. Um, so was I, and I shook it off and got up and <laughs> see. And then, I, you know, I was checked on him, and he was fine. I was like, dang, I might have to go and take something for this. Because he was like, he took it like a pro. Right, right, like, right. dude, okay, that's what's up. Welcome to my world a little right. bit. <laughs> he cried in the car. It's fine. He cried. He cried. I'm sure he did. I would have. I nearly did, and I just watched it. It was hard. It was. Woo, Good to see you, man. Yeah.